Don't do it. So he came to look at the little glass, John. And we looked. And we saw. And, we and we're going to zoom in. Hold on here. Let me see here. Where is it? Ah, my hand's in the way. Can't see the screen. Okay, and we'll pause this just for a second so you can see. That's the hole that I was trying to get in the shot. Another quick shot. I think I got it. No, I don't. Let's see. Boy, try pushing up and down, Dylan. Ready. So, yeah. Here, let's see if we can catch it from here. So, oh, I gotta zoom out. Big time. Where's my zoom? There we go. Wrong way. There. Right, it just, oh, it's pulling right out at the bottom. So I don't know if you can see that. Go ahead, keep trying. There we go. Yeah, the transom is bad. And I mean not bad. And if you, it's hard to see, but we'll zoom in down here. The stringers have come apart and chunks of wood are laying down in the bottom of the boat. And there we, there we go. There. Here, you hold it on me. It's filmed. So, the short version the $900 glass tron with a good motor and a good stern drive needs a couple thousand dollar fans on it. This is why you really want to look. One of the. Okay, so I'm not sure what happened here. Somewhere the sound cut out, so now you got me filling it in from the backside. Um, so short version, though, how we ended up down looking at this was we seen it on Marketplace, and it looked like a really good deal on Glastron. Maybe had a couple small issues. Got over there, and the transom was just rotted right out of the boat. I mean, just... But it's such a beautiful little boat. All that interior is all original. The, the bow right, everything. Like, this thing was garage kept and everything. And in the bottom, by where we shot in the beginning of the video, you could see a crack in the fiberglass down there at the bottom of the transom where it must have been leaking water and stuff in there. And it just rotted the bottom right out. Like, that motor would move up and down three, four inches. So, beware uh, what you're looking at, and, you know, just use your best judgment. And Sometimes a smoking deal just ain't a smoking deal. Till next time, have a good one.